In the past year, the lari has depreciated against the dollar by more than 30%, and against the euro by more than 11%. We here at ISETPI understand that Georgia cares a lot about exchange rates. So, let's take a little tour of small state exchange rates to see what's going on here. First, why does a currency lose value? For one, it has to be free-floating. This means the Central Bank of Georgia doesn't fix its value, like China does with the renminbi. Put simply, the exchange rate depends on the balance of foreign and domestic currency supplies out in the economy. And this follows the simple economics law of supply and demand. So, more dollars, less value. Fewer dollars, higher value. The same is true for the level of dollars available to Georgians at a given time. So, what does this mean? Since we know the lari lost value, this means that there are now fewer dollars available to Georgians. So, let's take a look at why this is the case. Exports, foreign direct investment, and other inflows like remittances are Georgia's main supply of dollars. All three of these sectors are down in 2015. Also, Georgia is a small state economy meaning that sometimes it is subject to the economic headwinds of the larger powers that Georgia trades with. Think about it. You don't see Reuters and Bloomberg running the course of the lorry on the front page of their headlines. But they will clamor on for days about a ruble or a dollar shock. So, when the ruble and the euro lose value, so does the lorry. Time for panic, right? Wrong. Currencies are a little like stock markets, or better yet, airplanes. Flying from Tbilisi to New York City, you are bound to encounter some bumps along the way. It may be uncomfortable at times, but the plane is going to reach its destination. Looking at the lorry this year shows some pretty bad performance. However, looking at the lorry over the last 10 years shows the behavior of one of the most stable post-Soviet currencies. One of the iron laws of economics is that everything evens out in the long run. So, sit back, relax, Georgia will fly through this monetary turbulence eventually.